Another unique biocolor technique is scraper art. Scraper art is great because it dries right away and has lots of magic and mystery. And it uses one of our favorite accessories, the biocolor scraper, which is a plastic tool with rounded edges. We'll start our scraper art with some easy ideas and then move to some more complex designs. First, we'll begin with color block designs, one of the easiest ways to go. You just simply swirl biocolor paint around your paper. This is a great one for the younger child. And now I'm going to take the biocolor scraper and move the paint around on the page and look at my design. So cool. Isn't that neat? Now what do I see in that one? I see the number eight. Oh, yeah. Shall we try some x-ray prints? Sure. You're going to paint some white biocolor on my hand. All right. And now I'm going to rub that around and print those on the page. At first, you're not going to see those handprints because they're white on white. But Gretchen's going to put some biocolor in black on the side and now scrape across. Ooh. Isn't that fun? Just like an x-ray. Look at that. Your own x-ray print. I love it. Now that's a hard act to follow, but I'm here to dazzle you with comments. Creating a comment on paper with biocolor paint is a little more structured and perfect for a school-age child. First, what you want to do is add a dime-sized dot of biocolor on the left-hand side of your page. Then you want to add circles around that dot. Sometimes you could add about four or five. This time, looks like we'll be adding four different colors. Makes for some good fine motor control practice for children. Right. And next, you're going to use your biocolor scraper to scrape the biocolor across the page. And wherever biocolor first touches the paper, the color stays. Oh, look at that. That is nice. Next, for an older child, you could add some shine using shimmer powder, which is a non-toxic metallic powder that is found on Discount School Supplies catalog or website. What you do is you're going to make your same comet with the circles and the dot in the middle and tap a little bit of this gold shimmer powder on top, then using your biocolor scraper and scraping it across the page. See how it left a little shimmer with the shimmer powder on there? That's fantastic. That looks great, Gretchen. Thanks. I love it. Now for the grand finale, magic writing, our most complex form of scraper art. But you'll see how magical it really is. I'm going to take white biocolor and write a short word. And this is going to be like my secret message. Now I've already placed some dots of darker biocolor on the left. I'm going to scrape it across. And look at that wow. Very cool. Pops right out of the page. Scraper art can be used to reinforce important developmental skills, such as eye-hand coordination, fine motor skills, and creative expression. Scraper art also enables children to explore paint media, predict outcomes, and to learn about the important principle of cause and effect. 